So welcome to the second JavaScript tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to display text to the user in two different methods. Well in fact one of the methods allows you to display anything including text. So you can display text, pictures, any HTML code really you can display. So let me show you both these methods. So the first one is where we actually embed it into the site and this is the method that allows you to embed code or images or anything into the site. Now you can see it looks as if it was done normally although I can prove to you if you source this is in JavaScript. So yeah uh, that allows you to put tags in you see I've put the italics tags and the bold tags in there and the second method is a pop-up box so if I refresh this you see we've got this alert I'm sure you've all seen pop-up boxes before and these cannot have any like code in it they can't have italics or anything like that so I'm just gonna close this now remember this is a template file we need to create a new file for this next project so what we're gonna do is file save a copy as and then this is gonna be um, I'm just gonna call it 2 for tutorial 2 save that and then what we can do is we can just edit this with Notepad++ so again this is where we're going to be typing our code um, so yeah so the first thing that I showed you was the document.write function that's the one that allows you to make it look like it's embedded into the site so we can do document.write and that takes brackets and then you do a semicolon JavaScript requires a semicolon to end each line um, so yeah you must end each line with one of these if you ever get an error in your code, check that you've got one of these uh, on every line, or every line where it's supposed to be there. Then here we can do speech marks, um, and then we can just say hello world. Like that. Save it, control S, and then run launching Chrome. That's assuming you're using Chrome. As I said in the previous tutorial, I recommend Chrome. So here we go, hello world. Um, so let's go have a look at the next type of uh, function we're going to do alert and it takes brackets again and then a semicolon and here you do speech marks again and it's the same thing hello world save it run launching chrome and you see we've got this pop up and it says javascript a lot up here but then here hello world so thank you for watching this tutorial I uh, hope you found it useful if you did, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next tutorial.